hi everyone and welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna to do a video on dry shampoos so as I mentioned before I did get the Sephora collection or Sephora favorites whatever it may be um, set of seven dry shampoos so they were all little minis um, and you got a chance to try all of them and then and then decide if you wanted to purchase one at the end so I did try all seven of them I did unfortunately not keep the package it is no longer available at Sephora I did pay $36 I believe but like I said it's no longer available so you can just purchase the little four ounce ones or the big ones um, the full size as well so I will go through all seven if I like them dislike them what I liked about them what I didn't like about them and then I'll show you a favorite that I purchased at the end the full size that I personally purchased from Sephora myself okay so to start off I'm gonna start with one that I really did not like so this one is the 24 karat Sally Hirschberger, so Supreme Stylist. So with this one, it does say it's a volumizing dry shampoo, but it is something that's similar to a hairspray. So because it is so wet um, and it doesn't dry, it dries very, very hard, um, it is very similar to a hairspray. So I would not consider this a dry shampoo. When I consider a dry shampoo, I consider something a little bit like baby powder, something that's gonna soak up those oils and it's gonna give me some texture and volume. With this, it really, it really is just like a hairspray. So if I wanna do like a sleek look, I'll definitely consider using something like this. You will know I do not like a dry shampoo if it's still full. So this one's still full, like one of the only ones in this package that's full still. Um, it doesn't smell good. Um, it doesn't stay. It's not something I would put in my hair to soak up excess oils because I feel like it would add more oils to my scalp. So definitely not a recommendation. Um, this one did come in the, the seven to choose from, but I probably would never repurchase them, this one again. So next is the Perk Up Dry Shampoo. This is the Amica one. I have personally purchased this one prior to this little set. It smells so good. It's very, very fruity. Um, it is a normal dry shampoo, so it soaks up those excess oils, but I find it probably does not volumize as much as a few of the others that I do have here. So this one is really, really nice. It says it smells like sea buckthorn berry, um, dry cleanse, refresh, revive for all hair types. So again, this one smells really, really good. With this product, I felt I used it up really quickly. Whether this be just a sample size or the full size, I did find that I used it up very quickly. So again, this is the Amica Perk Up Dry Shampoo. It is really, really good. You can purchase this one from Sephora as well. This I'll probably repurchase sometime down the line when I'm sick of all the other ones I have, but definitely a good, a good product and a good recommendation. So the next one is Bumble and Bumble. This one's called the BB Prep Prepa Powder. I don't know. I think that's how, how it's pronounced. Um, this one is still half full and I do use this quite often. So I find with this one, it's more of a texturizer, a volumizer, something where I lift up my hair and I shake a little bit in and then I shake it out. So I don't necessarily use this one for dry shampoo when I have lots of oils in my hair. I use it for more if I shower and then I have really clean hair and I need to add a little little texture, a little volume to it. This is something that I do use for that. Um, so it is a powder, so it's not a spray. So you can kind of see here, you take off the lid and there's a little shaker. So you kind of just shake it out. Probably something I wouldn't repurchase just because I hate the, the application of it. I want something kind of quick and easy in the morning. I want something that's gonna soak up those oils very quick. I don't just want something for texture. I also want something to soak up those oils. So this was a great one. I still will use it for texturizing. Um, I'll use it if I need a little bit extra more, more volume in a bun or a ponytail, anything like that I'll use this for. Um, but I probably would not purchase the full size just because I only use it to make my hair a little bit thicker and a little bit more texturized. So the next one here is called Bamboo Style. I have never heard of this brand before. I've never heard of this product before. Um, when I first got the packaging, I did think it was for brunettes because the packaging is, is quite brown. And you know how there's ones that are tinted with a little bit of brown, a little bit of blonde? I did think this one was tinted for brunettes. So it is not, luckily. Um, it is a universal uh, dry shampoo. But again, this one I found, I found that it was a little bit more of like a hairspray. So something that was a little bit more wet and not as dry and as um, powdery as I wanted it to be. So again, this one's still full. 
it smells amazing. So it's mango coconut. So if you like something that smells kind of like the beaches, <laughs> then this is a great option. Um, anything that I find that says translucent, so it says translucent dry shampoo, I find is a little bit more wet and a little bit um, more watery. So I don't reach for those normally. I want something a little bit more powdery. So again, I've never heard of this. It smells really good, but it is too wet of a dry shampoo for me personally. So next is the Chlorine dry shampoo. So this one I was surprised that was in the package just because it is a drugstore product. So I didn't expect it to be in there because it isn't prestige. And this product or in this package, like I said, is from Sephora. So I'm surprised it was in there. Um, with that being said, it is a really good dry shampoo. I really do like it. I have purchased this prior um, to this package, but I did purchase it from a drugstore. So I didn't purchase it from somewhere like Sephora. So again, I don't think you can purchase this from Sephora. You can purchase it from a drugstore, your local drugstore around you. Um, Chlorine always does have $3 off coupons as well at the drugstore. Um, but it's a great dry shampoo for someone who has really sensitive skin or really sensitive scalp. It's made for all hair types, long, short, brunette, blonde. It's just a normal, typical dry shampoo. It is something that is really good for sensitive people though. So keep that in mind because you're paying a little bit more for fragrance-free and more organic products. So if you need something that's a little bit paraben-free, gluten-free, that kind of thing, then go for something like this. I believe here in Canada it is $13 for the dry shampoo, but like I said, there's always $3 off coupons. Okay, so I did save the two favorites for last. So the first one here is the Detox. This is the dry bar uh, dry shampoo. So I loved this one. I did find that I used it not only to soak up the excess oils in my hair, but also to help with texturizing, volumizing, and longevity of my style of my hair. So my hair does not keep a style. So if I curl my hair in the morning, it will be out by the night. So it does not stay. But I found with this dry shampoo, it made my hair stay a little bit longer and the curls last a little bit longer. So um, I know that's probably because I don't have a lot of layers on my hair, but I don't really want any much layers either. But I know this really, really helped with it. So if you're looking for something to give you volume, texture, um, longevity for your hairstyle as well as soak up those excess oils definitely recommend this dry bar detox dry shampoo this one can be purchased from sephora i will be purchasing one of these as well just because it, it is so good so look this up give it a try um it's really really nice just a typical dry shampoo it smells really good too um it's used right up but oh my god it smells so good it smells kind of like like coconut but oh it's just so good go and get this one because this one's so good definitely recommend this guy give it a try okay so the last and my absolute favorite out of all the seven sephora collection dry shampoos living proof perfect hair day so i did purchase the full size of this so this is the one that came in the package and this is the full size i did spend 27 dollars on this but it is one that did not irritate my scalp it did not it did not clog the pores in my head. I didn't feel feel a buildup in my scalp. With lots of dry shampoos, sometimes there's a buildup um, in your scalp area and you kind of feel that you've used too much product. With this, I did not feel that. I felt that it was just clean, fresh. It smells really good. It smells just very clean and fresh. Isn't super fragranced. Anything like that. It does say six to six. 6 to 10 um, inches away from your hair, you spray it. It helped with volume. It helped with texture. It helped with... Um, my curls, it helped um, soak up those excess oils. It did all of the above. So the detox one and the living proof dry shampoo were my favorite. I did purchase this one, like I said, but I will be going back for um, the detox one as well. So as you can tell, I am a dry shampoo fanatic. I love anything that's going to help um, make me not wash my hair as many times as I'm supposed to every single week. So it is good for my hair, obviously, to have those natural oils and to not wash my hair as much as maybe I should. Um, I wash it probably two times a week, but it is because of dry shampoos. So be careful the dry shampoos you are using. Make sure you are cleaning your scalp really, really well because there can be a buildup of products. I have found that in the past as well that once I use so many products, I do get a little bit of a buildup of my scalp. So make sure you're using a clarifying shampoo as well. I hope you guys got a few recommendations here. Um, I'll let you guys know if I find out any other dry shampoos that I love.
If you guys have any recommendations of good dry shampoos that you think I need to try, leave them down below in the comment section because I love trying any new dry shampoos. So again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.